by the name of Allah who is kind and merciful welcome to the SCA today in this lecture we will discuss types of volcanoes in the previous lecture we have discussed the volcanoes and the its causes that why do volcano comes or why do volcanoes erupt so before going to start the lecture all of you are requested to please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you may get the notification at the earlier <clears throat> so let's start types of volcanoes there are four common types of volcanoes which we will discuss one by one the first common type of volcano are known as shield volcanoes these volcanoes are composed of fluid lava which comes out from multiple fractures and spreads over a large area. So this type of volcano is mostly composed of liquid lava which flows on the surface of the earth and the fluid nature of lava does not allow it to pile up and form an elevated structure like a warrior's shield so due to its fluid nature and its fluidity that doesn't uh, it doesn't find up at a single place and leads to the formation of an elevated structure which resembles like a warrior's shield <clears throat> so this is the first common type of volcano and example we see mount Kilauea and Mauna Loa in Hawaii are good examples of shield volcanoes. These two uh, Mount Kilauea and Mauna Loa and which are situated or located in Hawaii. These are the two good examples of shield volcanoes. They are usually found in constructive or tensional boundaries in the world in the world we will see that shield volcanoes will work that shield volcanoes are present only in near constructive or tensional boundaries so this is the first common type of shield volcano now we will move <coughs> toward the second common type of uh, volcanoes which is known as lava domes so let's continue now we will discuss the second type of volcano which is known as lava domes. These are produced from eruptions having less viscous nature. Lava domes volcanoes are produced from those uh, eruptions from those lava which have less viscous nature. This type of lava do not spread far and cool sooner and becomes hot. The lava which leads to the formation of lava domes does not uh, spread over a large surface and they occupy a small surface and they cool soon and becomes hot. They pile up around the vent or fracture and adopts a dome structure. These volcanoes are called lava domes because of the their structure which resembles a dome-like structure. The third type of volcanoes are called cinder cones. These are the most common type of volcanoes. The most common types of volcanoes are known as cinder cones. When the lava comes out of vent or fracture, forms a cone-shaped structure. These volcanoes are <coughs> known as cinder cones because they form a structure which resemble a cone shape. Cinder cones can rise as 1200 feet. The height of cinder cones maybe are usually 1200 feet above the surface of the earth. Cinder cones are found in Mexico. Most commonly cinder cones which is the third type and the most common type of volcanoes are mostly occur are mostly present or mostly located in Mexico. Now we will discuss the four 
type of volcano now let's move forward so the fourth type of volcano is known as composite volcanoes they are called composite volcanoes because they are composed of uh, different constituents so they are usually they usually give a very beautiful look and usually having a high top about 8000 feet these volcanoes uh, the structure of these volcanoes looks very beautiful and they have a, a great height up about 8000 feet they are also known as strato volcanoes and include mount kotofaxi and mount fuji in japan these two mounts are the examples of uh, composite volcanoes they are seen as massive mountains the structure or the body of these volcanoes are very massive and are formed by alternating layers of ash rock dust and lava and due to this composition of various constituents these volcanoes got the name of composite volcanoes they usually have steep slopes and a peak these volcanoes usually are almost have a peak, uh, peak structure having a steep slope. So the base of these volcanoes is broad and it becomes narrower and narrower with the height of these volcanoes increases from the surface of the earth. So in this lecture we have discussed the four types of volcanoes which are namely is shield volcanoes lava domes cinder cones and composite volcanoes i hope you have understand this lecture so please uh, it is requested again to subscribe to my channel and like the video thank you and god bless all of you